Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ray Cake and today I'm going to be telling you guys how I make money as an 11 year old. <laughs> so also real quick, if you hear any noises, just know my basement is under construction. There's a video coming up on that sometime soon. Well, possibly a few videos. <laughs> and also, I'm filming this at 11 o'clock on a Saturday night which you guys will be seeing it tomorrow, which is Sunday, because I need to film a video. So, this is the video you guys are getting. <laughs> so once again, this video is how to make money whenever like you aren't old enough to get a job or just like you want money to buy things, I guess. <laughs> so, we're still kind of in lockdown right now, so a lot of this or you, it, masks are required. Can I not talk anymore? Holy cow. <laughs> but anyways, I have a few different things that, I, that you can do to earn money. So let's just go ahead and get started. <sighs> the number one thing that I do is I make dog treats. And that might sound a little bit odd, but... It started off around Christmas time, and I just decided I wanted to have something fun to do. And I made flyers, and I gave them out around my school to teachers, and a few students wanted them. And then one of the secretaries ended up hanging it in, or like in the staff room or something. I literally almost every day after school, I was making dog treats because that's how many orders I got. I was selling a bag for about 35 dog treats for $3, and I made a decent amount of money off that. I still do it. I love making dog treats. It's just I haven't done it in a while because of lockdown. Um, and you also kind of do have to think about the fact, though, that you have to buy ingredients. And it's a lot of work. I don't regret it, but it's just a lot more work than... Because I didn't expect to make, like, I didn't expect a lot of people to want them. Like, I expected a few people, but not, like, every teacher that had a dog in my school. <laughs> and obviously, since it was Christmas time, they were, like, getting them for family members for Christmas presents. So that's a good idea to do for, like, around Christmas time, because then a lot of people will be, like, they'd buy more for like family members or whatever but so I made a pretty good amount of money off of that but you have to buy ingredients which is the only problem because three dollars a bag seems like a lot for the person buying it or maybe it doesn't but a bag of whole wheat flour a five pound bag is almost ten dollars and then cans of pumpkin are depends what brand you get mine's like a dollar ninety nine or something like that so just all the ingredients add up also so that's something to consider but that's probably the hardest one I'd say so I think yeah I have three different things that you can do so that's the first one the second one is to pet sit or babysit but I'd assume that not a lot of you guys are old enough to babysit yet, so if you have younger siblings you can, and you're allowed to stay home alone, you can try or you can ask your parent or guardian if you're allowed to babysit your younger sibling or whatever. I don't know how many times I say whatever in this video, <laughs> holy cow. And right now I am actually pet sitting for my neighbor, they are on vacation right now, and this today on Saturday is like my second day and I'm having a lot of fun they have two cats and a dog and really I just have to go over and let the dog out give them food clean the litter box it's pretty simple and I'm doing it till next Saturday so about a week or so but you can make flyers and pass them around your neighborhood you can with your parents permission like do a Facebook post and but that would be kind of difficult for like having to drive places a lot a day but once again like babysitting or pet sitting I don't know really how much I'm making off this pet sitting thing but I don't even know if I'm gonna like keep the money because I don't really I need it but at the same time I don't 
it's just whatever. It doesn't, my gosh, how many times have I said whatever? Holy cow. Anyways, so that's the second thing. I don't have a problem with it. I go over probably every like three hours. I run around outside with the dog. I feed and give the dog water. I clean litter boxes. So it's pretty simple. Like actual babysitting would probably be a lot harder. But I, <laughs> I like animals better than children. So I would rather just do pet sitting. And now I'm trying to think of a third thing. Oh yes, doing chores around your house. <laughs> now, my mom has pretty bad, that was a loud bang. My mom has pretty bad, bad back problems. So she's had two back surgeries within a year, like apart from each other. So she always wants like back massage, massages, massages, so. I do that a lot and I get paid for that and you can just like load or like wash dishes you could like Swiffer or sweep the floors and one of my friends actually she's doing a lot of things in the week and then at the end of the week she gets paid $20 which to me is pretty good especially for you living under your parent or guardian's roof and they still pay you for cleaning the house I almost said whatever but I didn't. <laughs> um, so those were the three things. I mean, I'm trying to think if there's anything else, but I don't think there is. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I think that's it. I mean, once again, dog treats, I've made a decent amount of money. I don't know how much I'm really gonna make off this pet sitting and I make a good, I swear if somebody's about to get in the shower. I really hope you guys can't hear that. You probably could though. <laughs> Anyways. So, oh yeah, like getting allowance and stuff like that. So like doing chores around the house. That's a great thing to do. I mean, it's simple-ish. Somebody's getting a shower. How fantastic. Thank goodness that's pretty much the end of the video. Um, this video was quite random, I do have to say because I kind of ran out of ideas, but I've been doing so good on like posting every Sunday because now like my schedule is posting on Sundays. I mean, a few weeks ago I had to post on a Monday because I had a graduation party on a Sunday and I didn't get to film a video at all. So, I think that's it. So make sure to actually like comment down below what you want me to do next because I'm running out of ideas really quick. I've done a lot of my ideas already and I can't think of anything else to do. I was thinking about doing some gaming videos, but those take a lot of editing and I don't even have a good editing software yet. I've been using the YouTube studio video editor just to like, and all you can do really in that is blur out things and, um, cut things out so I want to get a different kind of video editor so I can make the videos better for you guys but yeah I think that's it so I'm not trying to do like a 24 hour challenge because that involves a lot of editing so if you want to see me try to do like some videos with my brothers or I don't know when I'm gonna see Kai Cake again but I could try to do some videos with her again. I don't know though with Kai Cake because at her house that it's such bad lighting in her room. Like it's not funny whatsoever because it's so bad. So 99% of the time whenever we film videos we're at my grandpa's house. And we haven't been to my grandpa's house in forever. So yes, just comment down below what you want me to do next so that I can get some more ideas. And I think that's it. Yeah. So, make sure to give this video a big fat thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below what you want me to do next. And subscribe if you haven't already. And make sure to hit that little bell to turn on all notifications so you get notified every time I post another video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!